What's going on my fellow Jedi and Padawans? Welcome back to another Jedi gaming video. Thank you guys so much for coming back to the channel. And if you guys are new, welcome, welcome. Now today we're gonna be talking about a seasonal weapon from Season of the Seraph here, the Void Heavy Machine Gun Retrofit Escapade. Now this bad boy, I'm sure you've seen it around the space doing some crazy things with volatile rounds, being able to just annihilate bosses, heavy DPS, as well as just super, super fun to use, especially for a 900 RPM LMG. So we're gonna be able to go over our PVP as well as that gnarly PVE God roll for you guys inside of this video here. So hopefully you guys enjoy. Now, first right here, we're gonna be going over the PVP roll that I would craft with this weapon, earning my materials as we speak. So for our enhanced intrinsic trait, we're going range on this bad boy because it is that 900 RPM. It shoots very quickly and does have a little bit of bounce but i do think it is very easy to control that stability and recoil so having that stacked out in the range category feels best in the pvp realm for me since you don't have to keep continuously shooting very often so our first perk for the pvp realm is going to be small bore increases that range and stability plus seven for each of those so it just helps overall with the range keeping you guys back from those pulse rifles a little bit and being able to map and that stability so you don't got to worry about the bounce now next off we're going to go with accurized rounds again just so we're able to have that nice range because the stability on this is pretty good at 56 in my personal opinion so having that range be able to hit 50 with this lmg is super super clutch for the crucible realm so right here in our third column for our first enhanced straight for this weapon for p VP. I'm going with Zen Moment, so causing that damage increases its stability, plus it has improved base stability, so we get that plus five to our base, which is nice, like I said, to be able to laser people. Now, with that damage going on, the stability gets absolutely gnarly, or I should say the, the recoil, but like I said before, we don't have to hold down the trigger because it blows through Guardians, and it pairs perfectly with with the perk in our fourth column. The reason it pairs so perfectly is because tap the trigger so greatly improves the stability and accuracy on initial trigger pull. So this is nice when it stacks with dynamic sway by doing that consistent damage while just tapping the trigger instead of holding it down. You get some absolutely gnarly, gnarly stability with this weapon. So that's why I have it built out for the range inside of PvP, just because of how these other perks work together. You're able Able to just blow through guardians just tapping the trigger instead of at holding down your shoot button and just using the entire magazine at once so this thing very very fun to use even inside of the crucible Moving on right here to the PvE god roll that I know most everyone is here for, for this retrofit escapade, doing absolutely crazy things like this, creating volatile just explosions and juicing bosses, whether it be raid bosses, dungeon bosses, strike bosses, the combination of these perks with volatile rounds is absolutely nasty. So starting off with our enhanced intrinsic, we're going reload on this bad boy so we can get all the bullets downfield that we possibly can having that super super quick reload on those bosses helps keep up some max super crazy dps now again for our first perk i'm gonna go with small bore this might be controversial and some might pick others but i think with that range and stability how it is set out right here at 30 and 56 with this pve roll small bore just does the most for me in both of those categories getting us to that next threshold and just feels the best for me inside of that barrel column next off in the second column going tactical mag i absolutely love this for the pve realm it gives us increased stability, increased reload speed, and increased magazine size. So jack of all trades, helping us out in so many categories inside of the PVE realm. You could go with extended or appended mag, but those only give positives to like magazine 
while giving negatives to other like reload speed and stability. So definitely Tactical Mag is my go-to. So what makes this PVE roll so, so crazy for its high DPS with those volatile rounds is the combination of these last two perks. So first off, we got fourth times the charm. So landing those precision hits will return two to the magazine, increases the time between precision hits. So when you got something like a div bubble on a boss, pairing it with fourth times the charm in this, very hard to miss that critical spot. So you're able to just continuously shoot for a good long while. And when you do run out, you have that 87 reload speed to back you up. And then that pairs perfectly with our fourth perk that really gets the damage just going. That perk that I'm talking about is target lock new to this season. So damage increases by an improved amount the longer the weapon remains on a target. So when we're doing DPS on the boss, we're able to stay on that target for a very long time, allowing us to juice our damage up very, very high while reloading our gun via four times the charm. And those volatile rounds just start going absolutely mad, absolutely tearing tearing through bosses which i know you've seen plenty of videos on those in a background gameplay you can kind of see it going on as well so definitely be looking for target lock fourth times the charm on this bad boy for pve and get to just melting bosses with your void subclasses probably works the best on hunter because of that gyro falcon's hubric chess piece but you can also get volatility on both the other classes as well so not specifically for hunter but works the best with them especially for that crazy dps so thank you guys so much for watching truly appreciate it hopefully this helps you guys get this grinded out and pick your best perks for you i appreciate it i'll catch you guys in this next one peace